Hello to all my lively ladies. You're very welcome to today's sweaty, slimming cardio workout. Okay, let's get ourselves warmed up. Feeling good now today and feeling full of energy. So I hope you're feeling the same. And if you're not, don't you worry. By the end of this workout, we'll have the energy flowing for you. Let's march it out here. So what have we got coming up today? Looking forward to this. This is our cardio no repeat. So great workout to do if you have done a strength training session and maybe your muscles are feeling a little bit stiff and sore, or you just want one of those days where you'd like to move, want to get your workout in, um, but you're feeling a little bit fatigued. So this is a great one for you. So 24 moves, okay? Kind of keep you moving throughout this whole workout here. All right, let's get ourselves warmed up. Now our sequence today is 10.50, but as always, if 50 seconds is too much for you, you can always reduce that work time down to 40 seconds and just give yourself an extra 10 seconds rest. That's fine. If you don't want any rest at all, you're full of beans, full of life, just come in with me when you see me demonstrating the next exercise during that 10 second rest. Okay, nice simple moves as well. Got a few combination moves. Bringing back our low impact tuck jump. Haven't done that in, I don't think I've done that in months, that exercise. So bringing that back today. Let's add in a knee raise, forward and knee and back. And knee, forward, knee, back and knee. So just getting those hip flexors awake for us there and lift. And of course, you can always add weights to this class today if you want to. If you want to make it a little bit harder for you, increase that workload for the muscles. Let's do one more here. Now hold it on the spot. Crisscross those arms up over your head if you can. So just keep the weights light though. Whatever you do, don't add like a, a heavy pair that you may use for stationary strength exercises because you are going to be moving and keeping that body going and building up a good sweat here and pumping out those endorphins. Good work, okay. Reach right up, stretch out that torso and down in front. Two more with that one. And last one, let's step out to the side now. Out we go. Inner, outer thigh work here. Punch, punch, punch. Good. That's it, getting those back muscles warmed up as well. Tap out your toe, good. Now punch out the sky or the ceiling there. Drive all the way up. Good. Reach and reach. Reach and reach. Ten to go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now let's do some rainbow legs and open up those hips. Try and keep the hips square facing to the front. That's it. Well done. Good, and reach. Feeling a lovely pull and stretch in that groin, that inner thigh. Good, keep going. Two to go, and last one. Now let's do some stationary walks here. Now the first move's a hybrid move. It's a leg curl for four, and knee taps for four. Okay, let me quickly show you. One, two, three, four and sorry leg curl for four or whatever way we uh, i said the other way around <laughs> okay so knee tap for four good it doesn't really matter we're doing both and leg curl for four okay so whatever way you start it doesn't matter okay we'll just start with the knee tap so see if i just demonstrated it that way okay are we ready to go all right let's hit those timers have a good fun here enjoy yourself it's a lovely fun workout, it really is. I really enjoy putting this one together. Right, get ready, knee taps first. Okay. Oh, we have one of those days. One, two, three, four, and one. You can bring the arms back as well there if you want to get your back muscles involved. Two, three, four, and one, and two, and three, and four. Good, one, two, three, four and drive back for two and three and four good one two three and four and kick for two and three and four come on drive those knees up that's it and curl back 
So we're working the hip flexors at the front and hamstrings behind. Now with a double, double, you're gonna hear two there now, two, double meaning two, butt kicks and shoulder press coming next. Watch out for it there in the rest time. So here we go, double butt kick, double butt kick. I'm gonna add in the shoulder. I wanna stay with it. Get the legs first, then bring in your shoulders. Kick, 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 kick. Now again, I'm supposed to be doing butt kick. So that's a little bit closer than a leg curl. If it goes into a leg curl, it doesn't matter. Good. Punch out the ceiling. Punch and punch. Good. Reach right up there for me. Use your breathing to get through it now. Come on, you can do this. We're going to ski down next. Kick the legs out for two and continue ski. Kick the legs out for two. That's next. Well done, keep going. Feeling those shoulders. Come on, a few seconds to go. You're doing it. Well done. Good work. Whew. Ski down. Kick for two. Ski. Kick for two. Join me when you're ready. Have a little longer rest if you want to. That's it, you can kick down low like this. Or you can go a little higher. You can keep that back straight or if you have that flexibility. Kick, kick, good. Ski, kick and kick. Ski down, kick and kick, well done. Keep the back straight here. That's it, don't round your shoulders. Good work and ski, kick and kick. Now have a step back with back flies coming next. We're gonna hit the posture muscles. Good, kick and kick, ski down. Well done. Good, it's a nice fun move. It's getting the butterflies fluttering around in the tummy and kick and kick. Okay, there we go. All right, step it back, keep that heel up for me. Good. Back fly, and if you want, you can down, go down a little deeper with your knees. Just be careful, because we're bringing a bit of speed in here. And then up the tempo a little bit with our cardio workout. Step it back, watch that back heel now. Squeeze those shoulder blades. Come on, reach and squeeze, reach and squeeze. That's it, good work. Keep breathing for me now, don't hold your breath. Just bending slightly at the waist here, keeping the tummy muscles engaged. Good, step touch. Next, move five. Shoulder press, chest press, shoulder press, whatever way you want to do it. It doesn't matter which one you start with. Good. And squeeze it out. Come on, you can do it. Lift and lift. Ooh, getting that heart rate up. Stepping touch, step touch next. Bring one foot over to meet the other, and chest and shoulder, okay? Oh, my arms just need that extra few seconds. Good, we go for it. Chest and shoulders. Push out, shoulder, shoulder. This is my third video shoot today, and the first two were strength. <laughs> my arms are, oh, they're complaining a little bit now at this stage, but we push through. Good, push and over, push and over. Good work and reach and reach. Come on, you can do it. Reach up, push forward, reach. Pretend you're pushing water there, something heavy. That's it, that really makes a difference. Now we have three knee repeater next and then step back the opposite leg. Just staying on one side. Okay, let me show you. One, two, Three, step it back. Stay on the same leg. Step it back. One, come on. Two, three, step it back. One, two, three, and step it back. Pull those arms back. That's it, working the back muscles again and getting good stretch for the shoulders. Now, abs. Come on, drive that leg forward, work your tummy. One, Two, three, and step it back. One, two, three, and step it back. Come on. Who says you can't get that heart rate up? 
with low impact exercise you sure can good feeling the heart pumping away one two three and back good one two three and back last one and two and three and back now with the other leg to do keep marching if you're resting out keep the legs going by marching all right let's go one two three step it back come on one two three step it back have some fun with your exercise step back slow it down if you need to you don't need to be going at fast paces one two three we're going to keep going till we get to 24 moves yes you stay with me that's great one two three step it back one two and three and step good keep going two three finding that balance one two three now have some pendulums next we're going to work those little muscles that run along the front of the upper leg there those little hip muscles glute medius glute maximus so a little pendulum for me just like on a clock these little muscles here good and then we're going to open and close so we're going to stretch out that chest and work the chest as the arms come in stretch it as they go out so you'll feel your back muscles there if you have good mind muscle connection there from your nervous system to your muscles you will actually feel the shoulder blades retracting gently behind you there as the arms open wide slow it down if you need to feel that this is important that we know what muscle groups are working here we're not just going through each exercise with no purpose at all squeezing out these little glute medius minimus that's it good well done we're going to shovel the dirt next it's another one i don't think i've done in a while now it is sort of like a squat move but it's not a deep squat so give it a go you don't even have to bend the knees that deeply at all shovel the dirt over your head if you want to get down deeper that's fine you can do that but if you don't want to just a little drop of the hips will do fine little bounce there over the head watch the knees are they tracking out over the shoes that's good if they're collapsing inwards we've got to work on that so you know it's a usually a sign of a weak glute medius glute minimus muscle the one that we've just worked there are pendulums those little muscles here on the outside of the upper leg good that's it throw that dirt over your head so what move are you doing there do you know what it is yes it's a bicep curl so we're sneaking in the biceps without you even knowing it or maybe you did <laughs> good work now we're going to x the legs behind and we're going to reach out wide with those arms so great mobility for your if you want to start with the legs just get the legs down x behind don't trip over your feet so give yourself lots of room arms arms good feeling a lovely stretch again now for the shoulders upper chest working the shoulders a little bit as well that's it x and x so again leaning slightly at the waist here good that just allows you to get that little bit extra range of movement lift up well done how are you feeling now you're feeling a little bit warmer at least yes you're feeling energized i hope so that's good these are all good signs that we get from exercise keeping ourselves moving keeping ourselves mobile keeping ourselves healthy that's it good work mind and body well done okay now double step touch so let's go over to the side over over knee raise over over knee raise join me now when you're ready knee good knee and tap out your knee come on have fun i love double step touch and we did single step touch with chest press shoulder press we're just doubling here doing two together and then adding on a knee if you're a little bit confused one two you can leave out the knee raise okay you don't have to include that adding on just makes an exercise that little bit more 
complicated if that's the word but it's just a little bit more coordination is needed but if you haven't done double step touch before you're new here maybe try even go back to single step touch that's it good and you can add on when you're good and ready that's fine well done now we have a little squat march it out there if you need to so we're doing a little squat leg raise and a lateral raise okay now again we're working those you notice there's a pendulum uh, in here so we're working those little muscles in the hip sit down reach good sit your bum down reach and reach good work and reach and again it doesn't have to be a deep squat just a little bounce of the hips will do watch you're not falling to the side so use your tummy muscles to keep your spine erect upright that's it good and reach and lift and reach good work well done a couple of seconds left and then we'll head into reverse heel taps now i added this one to a workout recently i absolutely loved it so i said i have to get it back in again so we usually do a forward heel tap we're going behind now reach with those hands or punch out in front if you want to don't worry if you don't touch your heel that doesn't matter just in that general area you will do fine you can just do this uh, saturday night move uh, whatever that film was <laughs> saturday night um fever whatever they called it that one okay don't worry if you can't tap out that heel and reach and reach come on you're doing great reach up reach up good now we have a squat thrust next don't worry if you hear squat again it's just a little little seat there in the middle for two and uh, two arm moves two uppercuts two boxing moves good nearly there feeling a lovely stretch for the front of your legs the quads yes okay just trying to make you aware of all these moves in your body all right squat thrust for two and then one two you might want to open your legs about shoulder distance here for this one one two one two good so we are accelerating the muscles and then decelerating good keeping them guessing all the time here that's it one two good reach reach this would be a lovely one with a pair of dumbbells i must add this to a strength workout one two one two good one two we're going to work those glutes again next we're working them here you can feel them working one two i'm going to do some glute squeezes and reach up high one two one and two one and two good work well done okay now butt squeezes so i want you to feel your bum working here okay so get the legs down first now reach up reach thumbs up for me that's it good reach keep the arms close to the ear lobe you should feel them literally brushing off those ears there good and squeeze and squeeze come on you're doing great hopefully you're not feeling the lower back giving out there feeling it in the glutes so you should be feeling like you're squeezing water out of a big sponge good now we're going back to work the hamstrings next a leg curl and we're going to add a tricep extension see how you go with it good well done kick kick back that's it just there now last one okay well done now curling the leg leg curl leg curl okay now i want you to really feel the hamstrings here good now that's it and try and get your hands down to your upper back there the back of your shoulders if you can you might have to work on mobility a little bit there good this one is quite tiring now you can speed it up if you want to i'm just trying to really feel those hamstrings contracting but we are doing our cardio <laughs> okay well done 
kick, kick. You're doing great. This one might feel a little bit awkward. I hope you have your hair tied up, otherwise you're going to be bringing it with you. Good. Now we're going to step across the room or shuffle across the room and kick out and reach. Either side. Again, it's another one of these add-on exercises, so you don't have to do the add-on. So either step across the room, kick out and reach, or shuffle across the room, kick out and reach. You can just step or shuffle back and forth, leave out this bit here, the kick and reach. Another leg. Well done, make sure you're switching legs. Sometimes I get halfway through the exercise and I realize I'm still on the same leg. Okay, so just again, making that mind muscle connection with what you're doing with your exercises. Good. Now the low impact tuck jump is coming. You can let me know in the comments if you've ever done a high impact tuck jump. It's an extremely advanced exercise where you literally tuck your knees up into your chest and jump up into the air. Don't worry, we're not doing that. We're going to go low impact. Last few seconds here. Good. Well done. Okay, we finished it out there. Let me show you the next one. So one, there's your knee tuck. And then your low impact jump, okay? So if you see it here, you tuck your knees up and you jump up in the air, very advanced. Good. If you ever want to try it, if you have a rebounder there, or a trampoline, mini trampoline, you could try it on that. Just be careful though. Reach up. One, two, sit and reach. One, two, sit and reach. Keeping the back nice and flat. Good, sit and reach. You can still get your heart rate up here. These nice bouncy ballistic exercises. Sit and reach. One, two, sit and reach. Now we have a side step coming next. Just let the legs continually step out to the side because we're switching up the arms and you might think the legs have to switch up too, but they're not. They're doing their own thing. Okay, so side step. Commit to side step. That's all we're doing with the legs. Then we're going in, out and up. In, sorry, out, in and up. Okay, I have to get the flow here. That's it. Out, in, up. Good. If you're getting confused, just go out and in with the arms. Leave out the up over the head bit. That's it. Good. You'll get it. You'll get it. I have faith in you. Come on. That's it. Out, in and up. And the legs are just going stepping out and back in. And we're getting our inner thighs and outer thighs work there. So we are good while we add in the upper half, getting all four limbs to move, keeping the heart rate elevated till we are finished. Good, come on, you can do this. Let's hear you breathing. Stay with me there. Good. Now we have our stationary walks next. Usually one I put into a walking workout. But I said I'd put it in here today. On the spot, stationary, forward and back, and getting those big arms going for me, okay? Join me if you don't want any rest. Take rest, more rest if you need more than 10 seconds. That's perfectly fine. Now, we're gonna work one leg at a time here. The other stationary leg, now you're gonna feel. Come on, just drive those arms. Pump those arms for me. You're doing wonderful. Keep going, come on. Drive, drive, good, well done. Like you're running on the spot here, or walking fast on the spot even. Ooh, feeling that stationary leg burning a little bit now. Up on the toe with that moving leg. Don't force that heel in for me, keep it up. Good, 10 seconds and you're done. Come on, stick with me, we'll shake out that leg. Well done, just there, okay. Ooh, it's such stationary leg I have to shake out. Okay, now we have the other side to do for move 21. Well done, you're doing wonderful. Forward and back, forward and back. Good. Come on, pump those arms for me. You're doing great. Well done. That's it, keep the chest upright. Just a slight little bend of the waist. Slow it down if you want to. You don't need to go fast. That's perfectly fine. Come on, you're all crushing this no repeat workout today. Keep going. 
well done driving those arms for me we've less than 15 seconds come on you can do that Woo, feeling the burn getting that heart rate up come on stay with it three seconds just there now and you made it can you be clapped for those in a row? two in a row my goodness all right two knee raise one two two step forwards or two lunge forwards whatever you can do okay one two lunge if you can lunge or just step it forward good step line up the feet step okay whoops get that balance it's good maybe to look forward here to help you with balance a little bit good one two lunge lunge if you can one this would be a good one to do up against a wall you could hold on to the wall for a little bit of of assistance there while you build up strength in your legs and your knees one two good one two now we've another step touch coming they've uh, come in a good bit today it's a single step touch this time for four one two three four and then knee across the body for four okay all right nice combination move before we finish up one two three four one two three four one two three four and one you're feeling the abdominals working there as the knee crosses the body good two three four and now abs engaged and really feel the tummy muscles working well done one two three four and one and two and three and four come on keep going one two three four and now drive across one you might have to slow this one down a little bit three and four and let's get our step touch in three and four well done one move left now the last move i've just kept it so simple they're just light little jogs now if you don't want to jog you can do a fast march on the spot and you can even bring in some triceps if you want to get a little bit tricep worked today okay so a little jog or fast skipping on the spot even with the jogs you can push those arms back get your old tries worked there now if you liked today's workout i'd appreciate a thumbs up and that really i do know you like the you no know, repeats though but again the quicker we get those likes out on the videos the quicker the chat the video will be pushed out to ladies just like yourself who want to find a channel like this and get fit so we'll be helping other people as well and you'll also be helping me to grow the channel great well done push back push back good work and you made it huge clap to you that was amazing excellent work i hope you're feeling nice and energized and rejuvenated and all these lovely positive words now as much as i am really feeling great now rearing i could go again now with another nice cardio workout there i love the cardio i know people kind of criticize cardiovascular workouts and say they you shouldn't do this you shouldn't do that but just for the mental benefits and the mental health i just absolutely love them they just make you feel so good now i'm going to link up a cool down for you i have to run now so you'll find lots of cool downs posted in my in the description box underneath the video there you'll find them in my playlist drink your water as always i always encourage you to drink your water it's so important to be amazed by the amount of people who forget to drink water throughout the day and get into that kitchen Put your healthy meals together yourself know what ingredients are going into your food and allow yourself treats every now and then no harm thank you so much for all your likes again and comments on the video and all your support on the channel i really do appreciate it and i will see you in the next workout see you soon